In more good news for motorists, most Clipsal road closures were reopened this afternoon. And with record crowds at this year's car racing carnival, it was only fitting it was given a rock star farewell. Kissing Clipsal goodbye. <laughs> To a crowd of 45,000, the 1970s glam rock act joined Motley Crue for a show-stopping finale. The international acts capping off one of the biggest Clipsal events of all time. We had a record crowd yesterday of 95,000, which is a fantastic turnout and probably surprised all of us to the point where we had to go sell out. But after the rocking and rolling comes the clean-up. Five and a half thousand staff members are now in a race against time to get traffic conditions back on track with some restrictions easing this afternoon. We've got a lot of cleaning up to do. Uh, our first priority today is get the roads open. While one event may be over, another is just beginning. And this is going to be a square for people. The Victoria Square redevelopment will feature an event space fit for 10,000 people, but it's already coming in over budget. The $24 million price tag now revised to $30 million. We are only borrowing a very small amount, uh, yet to be finalised, and that will be at record lows. The council is confident the works will be completed in time for the Tour Down Under in 2014. Jessica Stanley, Nine News.